you for coming in. So in the periodic table, you see AU as the symbol for gold. So we are about to reveal to you the latest generation of, of iScan. It's iScan Choreo AU. So ladies and gentlemen, that's our latest generation, highest speed, factor of two improvement in speed, iScan Choreo Gold. So as a companion to iScan Choreo Gold, we set out to entirely transform the experience for the pathologist. So the idea was, this has to be something that they actually want to use. I could go on, but unfortunately, words would not do justice. So let me just, uh, without further ado, show it to you. And if you would know it. to come in and experience at the various workstations for yourself. Welcome. I'd like to invite all of you to come a little bit closer into the bioimaging booth uh, for the first installment of our Conversations About Digital Pathology series. We're very uh, fortunate to have with us this afternoon Dr. Liron Pantanowicz uh, from Bay State Medical Center in Massachusetts. So digital pathology serves many functions primary diagnosis, secondary opinions for consultation, telepathology. Good morning. Uh, I'd like to introduce Dr. Braun. Uh, he's Managing Director with uh, National Consolidated Technologies. Healthcare reform has been approved. The government has decided to uh, create uh, the conversion of all manual records to electronic medical records, and they're willing to pay for this. I'd like to uh, welcome Dr. Mahul Amin. He's the, the chairman uh, of laboratory medicine and pathology at Cedar sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles. Our field of surgical pathology is uh, clearly at a very interesting crossroads as we integrate uh, our role as morphologists and take part uh, and, and integrate all the exciting events that take place in molecular pathology to make a difference in the lives of the patients. It's my great pleasure to introduce Dr. Sanford Barsky. He's currently the chair of pathology for the University of Nevada, as well as the vice president of the Nevada Cancer Institute. Digital pathology and the ability to scan glass slides into a computer and apply digital algorithms introduces an objectivity into the process. I have the pleasure today of, of announcing uh, our final speaker, Dr. Subo Lele from the University of Nebraska Medical Center. So at UNMC we have uh, three uh, scanners from Biomagine and for the first time um, last week we had a live surgical pathology conference with a group of pathologists from Mumbai, India. And during this conference, uh, I was essentially uh, in my bed using a laptop, and I was able to see cases that were sent to me from a hospital in India. 